if you know, you know. In this video, you're going to hear how DMX talked about how Biggie got signed with P. Diddy and what went on. Do you have any memories of Biggie that stick out to you? I only met him once. Tell us about that. Well, you know, locks got signed by Diddy. Even though I bought the locks to our fighters, you know, they got signed. They were a safer group. You know, Pop signed them. And it was a blessing and a curse because you know, they were sure they were happy about getting signed first and they were on the Benjamins and shit was going on. But then he made them jiggy and put them in suits and and made them made them write lyrics for him and took all that publishing and raped him. Like, damn. I'm glad I didn't, you know. I guess you could argue that he was just saying that he took all his rights away. But in that video, he was talking about how he never seen Biggie smile. You could actually look that interview up. And there's a lot of suspicious videos of him exposing himself. I, I should look like he fresh off got their plane. I should, I should, I should, I should. Fresh off the guard stage. That's my brother right here from day one. We used to wake up and, I mean, damn, pause. But like, check this out. I mean, I mean, back in the days when he was like 10 and I was a little bit older, his older brother, we used to fight over the, over the frosted flakes. You know? You literally seen how raised him as he said they used to wake up together. He shut himself up and Kevin Hart started laughing hysterically because he knows what's going on. And then he said they used to fight over Frosted Flakes when he was 10 years old. Usher's 43 years old and Diddy's 52. They're nine years apart. <laughs> but it's my brother for real. We used to actually wrestle off of the... All for the frosted flakes because he used to always get up early. <laughs> now he's one of the richest dogs in the world. And I'm Yo, like, what the fuck did Puff just say? Right. Nobody's gonna acknowledge this for me. Puff just said we used to wrestle over the frosted flakes and we're streaming live. That was stupid. Listen, that was fucking stupid. Listen. <laughs> And in this video, you can see him acting suspicious, calling other dudes daddy and asking them why they don't party with him, making them real uncomfortable. Yeah, I love this drink. Where you put my bag? I like yeah. when you like this, Daddy. Yeah, yeah, where you put my bag? Daddy, yeah, I like when you, oh, when you right scrambling here, right and here. scraping for no, 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 shit. No, 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 no. I, got I like shit. that. You know, I'll be practicing. Fuck, like I'm going over that one. Make a that wish. One. Just blow it out. It's your no, birthday no. every day. Every day is your birthday on Drink okay. Champs, goddammit. I'm in. Where I look, Did you look miss back me? on where I became. Mm. Did you miss me, though? Mm. For real, because we, I'm saying, it seems like a thing. I miss his birthday party. Man, I'm talking about for your birthday. Huh? Why won't you party with me for your birthday, man? I'm, I, yeah, we we party for my birthday before. You came to my party. And... No, but me and you ain't never really party. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I... Make you wonder what kind of party he's talking about. Like, this guy got to pick it up from right there. Look, look at this nigga. This nigga. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Go ahead. Go ahead. No, 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 bro.